Hello and welcome to the IT Convergence User Productivity Kit tutorial series. This is a demonstration of how to use folders and structure content to enhance the user experience in Oracle's UPK developer. Working with folders in UPK is similar to the way that Windows Explorer lets one organize files on a computer. As in any organizing process, especially in UPK's multi-user environment, it is essential to create a logical and simple folder structure for the documents. This will make it easier to locate the documents when building an outline. When opening the library in UPK, it displays a series of pre-built folders that contains various documents. The systems folder is an example of a folder created by default, which is a part of the developer application. System documents include standard icon packages, publishing styles, templates, and master role lists for all supported languages. The first step in working with folders is to create a new folder and select the desired location for it. Click the File menu, Point to New, and choose Folder. Enter an appropriate name and click OK. Keep in mind that a parent folder cannot contain two subfolders with the same name. To create a child folder, select the folder that was just created and repeat the process. In the library, displayed to the left is the folder pane, which is organized in a tree hierarchy. Displayed to the right is the contents pane, which includes all subfolders within that folder. In order to view all subfolders in the folders pane, expand the folder by clicking the plus symbol in the folder list. To collapse the folder, click the minus symbol. To rename a folder, select the desired folder in the folders pane or the contents pane. Right click the folder and choose Rename. Type the new folder name and press Enter. The final topic in this tutorial is how to delete a folder. Deleting a folder deletes the entire contents of the folder, including all documents and subfolders. Select the desired folder, right click and choose Delete. This will open a Confirm Delete dialog box prompting to confirm the action. Decide the preferred option and click OK. This concludes our tutorial on how to structure content with the help of folders in Oracle's UPK developer. On behalf of IT Convergence, I would like to say thank you for your time and invite you to join IT Convergence YouTube channel where you can learn more about the User Productivity Kit features and functions.